Hello from Tennessee. So I decided to change up my straps on five of my watches. So I'm gonna go through them quickly. Uh, in my opinion, if you are in this hobby, you need to be into uh, straps. I think at the end of the day, it's a very affordable way to be able to uh, change up your watch collection um, fairly quickly, fairly quickly. And if you've got a good abundance of straps, which I do, um, it's affordable too as well. So first up, I've got my Raven here and I had picked up this Westbro strap and I had it on my, uh, uh, my Dune Shore Shallows Tangerine and I thought it would look killer on this. You know, as we're moving into the cooler months, um, got some leather. Um, I think this looks kind of fun and kind of fallish. So we got that one. Next up, we have the Visitor Dune Shore uh, Shallows. And I put it on this uh, Visitor branded uh, leather strap, super pliable, super comfortable. I'm looking forward to this, um, wearing this and checking it out on the strap. Um, I think it looks great. Feels good. Looks good. Next up, a recent acquisition, my Tissot PRX. I took it off the bracelet and wanted to try it on the rubber. So I got the, the blue rubber strap for it. Um, I think that'll be fun, and uh, I believe this is FKM. Let's see if it says, I can't tell. It feels like FKM, but very pliable, very comfortable. Looking forward to trying that. Um, quick releases on this work really well, really easy to change up. So that's pretty cool. And then um, I have my uh, Dracula monster here, and I put it on this Miltat strap, which I think is going to look really good on, actually. So, looking forward to check, trying this out on this, but I think that's a really nice combo there, too, as well. So, there's another one. And last but not least, um, my limited edition name I cannot pronounce, Seiko. Uh, decided to put it on this Montreux rubber strap. I actually ordered a couple of leather straps. Oh, actually, they're 20 millimeters, so I don't have a lot of 22 mil straps. I have mostly 20, so um, that's why I put it on this. But I'm even thinking. You know, this is a 22, this is a 22 mil here too as well. I think that would be interesting. I've got an orange Miltat um, Tropic strap that could look good on that. But you know, potentially this brown leather, I think that actually will look pretty good on it too. So, but anyway, the point of this, and I just knocked my name over there, so. Little OCD kicking in there. So the point is though that, you know, in this hobby, um, straps are a really affordable way to do it. I have a couple of uh, Montro, they just released a leather strap and I'm really anxious to try. I've got a couple of those inbound. Um, they, it looks like a super pliable, thin leather that I think will be good on a couple of the watches I have. So, um, but my strap collection is getting pretty good. I'm getting, you know, the, the straps I like. Montro is definitely one of my favorite. Can't go wrong with Miltat. Um, these Wes Pros are, they had a lot of fun, different colorways. And then Strap Habit has some great stuff too as well. So all that stuff is, a uh, pretty cool for sure. So that's it. As always, stay positive, make friends, enjoy the journey. Take care, everybody.